we're going to go back and forth. You're going to pick an issue that you typically hear for customers when they talk about performance issues. So you're just going to give me one topic, right? Whatever it happens to be, profiles, whatever. And we're going to go back and forth until we can't get to one. You ready? Sure. I'll start. Well, you already nailed one, so I'll, I'll give you a freebie. You already got first one, which is the network, right? The end user network performance issues, right? Yeah. That's number one. I'll take the next one. Profiles. Size of profiles, information that's going into the login time for profiles. So all the location of the profiles, observability is going to help to find some of that data and kind of tell you that, hey, some of these users have large profiles. So you take the next one. Group policy. So processing all the potentially outdated and legacy GPOs, group policy objects that have existed in the environment. Maybe it's been built on top of for 15, 20 years, and I've got 20 years of junk you have to clean out. They're all processing and the user feels it when they sign in. Great one. Infrastructure, I'll go next. So typically sizing of infrastructure, the amount of applications, the size of the VMs. Very typically, we run into customers that have outgrown their original sizing for their deployment. And so observability is going to be able to give you some of that data. Maybe the applications are using more memory than you originally had scoped or planned for. Uh, maybe you're trying to understand that more people are using different applications. Common one, how many people are using multiple web browsers inside of their virtual desktops today, even on their physical desktops? How much RAM is being eaten up by those applications? So that's my next one. Next. Application performance. So it's different from the infrastructure. It, the application itself could be could be throwing errors, could be running a stale process and it's hanging up on the application servers. That doesn't show up on an infrastructure report. So let's say you have a tool deployed in your environment to monitor the infrastructure. It might not catch an application or an application level issue. A specific process, a specific script is hanging. That's something that you can catch through the session data in Citrix for sure. 